do not understand. Does the Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. <laughs> He's got the gift of the gap. Can't be denied. But I need to steal your buddy for a sec. What are you? There's no time to waste, B. Goro, good to see you. As it is to see you, B. I acquired some information on my own. Do you know who most wished to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. And how you aim to manage that? While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Right? Then what? I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Let us move on. Take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, getting more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work, I will watch your back. Now, get to it. worked. And? Done. System's ours. The shot works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. 
See you tomorrow. I can't believe I'm saying this, but this Sokka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. Bridge we might cross, but only might, we'll see. Glad we're on the same page. You never know what a dog's thinking. Might be the same thing. What? Is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako Sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. So, I convinced Hanako-sama of the truth. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let him off his leash. Let him stray even a couple of feet and you can say goodbye to his fucking honor. Go with him, V. You're a stranger in a strange land. I'm going with you. Hmm. True. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Louder! Louder! You already know. In the flesh. He eliminated the vast obstacle between himself and the complete power. And they surrendered it to him. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that enough? Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could've kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong, and disciplined man, the strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinov returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinov from the consequences of his deeds. Feels like that's about to change. Long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events, Conscience could also come into play, assuming she's got one. We must reach her first. Will you join me? Sure, why not? Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So does the plastic.
come. I have found a good place to observe. We must just climb up here. Now, this way. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much? Hmm, perhaps I am simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. Got eyes on the comm system. It's a lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Trucks drive up regularly. Are we to hijack one? Camouflage turrets by the gate. A last resort. I do not wish to die there. This is not bad. Pipes. See him? We could use them to get inside. I think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So, we going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in then. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. <coughs> B. What? what? No sudden movements. Do you see it? That cat? Fine-looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a bacchanal. Chill. Just a cat. Perhaps. Perhaps not. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko too. 
Where'd you grow up, anyway? I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once, when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah, bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. What was it like growing up in Chiba 11? I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slum. Arasaka selecting children, but only the clean ones. What did they need kids for? To be corporate soldiers. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. And all you had to do in return was kill Saburo's enemies. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Wasn't judging you. And true, you oppose the corporations, their order, their world, in a mindless way, yet you offer no worthy alternative. Take a look around. It's here. Your corporate world and its glorious splendor. You show me filthy streets as if no other world exists, as if nothing else is possible. What of the millions who work for Arasaka and receive stability, safety? The Chiba 11 slum rats? They're there, scraping scraps out of scop tins. Corpse decided that, too. We cannot fix everything at once. Tired of bickering. Let's just drop it. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world, forget everything. Nomads aren't lone wolves with egos. Whether they're blood or not, family comes first. Yes, but we need not quibble over details. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompeki. We both have lost someone important, and we are not at peace with this, so we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Finally starting to make some sense. There's one thing you should know. It is about Mr. Wells. About Jack? What is it? When I set out to find you, others went to find Jackie. They took his body. For the life of me, can't figure why. So his mom couldn't give him a proper send-off? Arasaka has a method for pulling information from the dead. What are you talking about? Don't ask for details. I understand little. I know they use the Soul Killer program to do so. They can pull an engram from Wells' body. Damaged. Incomplete. But still an engram. Motherfuckers. Evil. Jackie's psyche. Where are they keeping it? This, I do not know. Why am I only hearing this now? I did not know I could trust you. The circumstances have changed. The Baganenko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. I think it is time to do something, hmm? 
Oh, fuck, fuck get, get worse. worse. You do not look so bad. Shoot! Oh. Shoot! Yeah! I'm 
Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I'll raise the control room and make no! a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. He's shooting! <laughs> Drop your weapon and show yourself! He has no right to leave! I know you're in here. I can feel it. Approaching target! What the... What now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. As if I wasn't in enough already. <laughs> 